Hello and welcome to word list 7. In this word list there are 10 words and today we are going to learn about these 10 words. These words are abhor, arbitrary, clairvoyant, debauch, embezzle, grievous, irreverence, palatable, rebuke, tenuous. The first word is abhor means to hate or detest. She abhorred the smell of dirty laundry. In this picture we can see a girl and she is making a scrunch face because she hates the smell of dirty laundry. The second word is arbitrary means based on the desire or idea or chance rather than reason. To base anything on a desire or idea rather than giving a reason about something. Her outfit was an arbitrary choice but was just perfect. In this picture we can see a girl, she's wearing a dress shirt with skirt and she has an oversized coat but she's looking perfect. The third word is clairvoyant, a person who claims to have a supernatural ability to perceive events in the future, a person who thinks and who says that he can see future. She has had a message from a clairvoyant that her son is alive and well. Fourth word is debauch, means destroy or debase the moral purity of corrupt. The young man's honesty was debauched by the prospect of easy money. A young man's honesty was debauched and was corrupted by the idea of uh, earning money easily. The fifth word is embezzle, means to steal money by falsifying records. He was caught embezzling money from his clients. In this picture we can see a man and he is taking a lot of money from his clients. Sixth word is grievous, means injurious, hurtful, serious or grave in nature. The loss of his father was a grievous blow. In this picture we can see a man and he is grieving. Seventh word is irreverence, means disrespect. He always treated other people with irreverence. In this picture we can see a man and he is uh, fighting with other men and uh, definitely he is disrespecting him by putting on a fight with him. Eighth word is palatable, means agreeable to the taste or sensibilities. Anything that uh, your uh, taste buds or your uh, senses think is good. He put the cup to his lips and swallowed a mouthful of surprisingly palatable coffee. In this picture we can see a man and he is drinking coffee and we can see from his expressions that he is enjoying coffee. The ninth word is rebuke, means to scold or criticize. He was unable to complete her due project, that's why she rebuked him. In this picture we can see a boss and she is reprimanding her subordinate. The last word is tenuous, means having little substance or strength. Despite working out for two months, he still has a tenuous body. In this picture we can see a skinny man and he um, thinks that he has a body but he has a very little substance and strength on him. That's it for today. Thank you so much.